Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel and welcome back to a new video. I'm just in the car with my... Beyonce. <laughs> I was going to say chauffeur. <laughs> but yes, my chauffeur as well as my fiancé and we are getting married next year. <laughs> Last night we sent out all the save the dates and we just have a few more extra ones to do today. So we're going to deliver some save the dates to our friends and then I'm dragging Jake to the shops with me as well. I want to go on a little shopping spree just to see what's new in in the home decor shops for 2023. I want to go to Matalan and we might also go to like Home Sense, CK Max Home Bargains over at this like retail park near us. So we'll just see where the vlog takes us. home now and I've got the goods kind of reminds me of the Powerpuff Girls all these three bags <laughs> and we also got some things from Dunelm as well which I'll show you so yeah I'll just show you everything that I picked up there's some quite cute little bargains today so first as you will have seen we went to Matalan and Matalan was quite disappointing actually there was hardly anything in there at all I vlogged a few different like cute bits but I didn't want to like buy anything nothing was tempting me enough to buy it so then we went to HomeSense and obviously I can always find stuff in HomeSense I picked up this really cute bowl or bowls because it's two bowls for the bunnies how cute is that with a little bunny on top with a carrot and then i thought you could have pellets in one side and the water in another side and it's just cute and girly and i just like to get cute things for the bunny so i got that and then i also found one of these so they had two left on the shelf and i've been after something like this for ages and i did find one in tk max home sense a while back but it said like 50 quid or something and it was smaller than this so i'm not sure why it was priced like that but this one is 12.99 it's a really good size it's like a plate but more of like a bowl type thing and i think they look perfect by a sink in bathrooms or kitchen and you can like place amber bottles on there or any of like your normal like hand wash and hand cream you could pop a little soap on there i just think they're really good for styling and yeah i'm so glad that I managed to get one and then I actually saw I might have inserted it on the vlog I actually saw my blocks of soap I got mine from habitual home I think like a green block of soap I actually saw them in home sense and they did like a yellow one as well and they had two different sizes too but because I've already got one I didn't want to get another one so I did get two different bars of soap so this one say citrus and it smells insane like citrus is my favorite scent anyway when it comes to like fragrance and things and I just think it smells 
really clean. I probably will unwrap it, but the, the wrapper, the packaging is really nice. And I thought it would look quite nice on there with like something else, maybe like um like a small tea towel, like a napkin or something for a bit of bathroom sink styling. And then I also got this one as well. I think that one's a little bit prettier with the packaging. Lemon and sage with sheer butter. And that smells really nice as well. So yeah, I thought they look really cute, styled in bathrooms or by a sink. And because they smell so strong, I feel like they'll be kind of like a room freshener at the same time. So two in one. <laughs> then we went to TK Maxx. And if you have like a home sense of TK Maxx near you, you'll know that they pretty much sell the same stuff. Like I saw the teak like wooden plate thing in TK Maxx as well but there are sometimes a few different things and I did get some new oven mitts a bit of a boring thing to show you but we need new oven mitts desperately ours are like <laughs> disgusting and I thought these were nice and neutral but if you look closely there's little bunnies on them so I thought they were perfect for florally home the florally bunnies and then this is something else for the rabbits I'm sorry if I'm boring everyone just buying rabbit stuff but I literally couldn't help myself when I saw this we give Bonnie like veggies and her herbs every other night or like every night if if we're feeling generous because she does love them and we can't give them blossom yet because she's too young but we do give them to bonnie and i thought that this plate was just so cute to give her the veggies on because it's like a lettuce with a bunny on so i just thought it was so sweet and i couldn't i couldn't leave it on the shelf then we went to Home Bargains and this was my first time going to the new Home Bargains that's just opened near me and it was huge, like the biggest Home Bargains I've ever seen. So yeah, if you are wanting to go to a really good Home Bargains, go to the Capital Centre one because it is very, very good. And we did get some cream eggs. I know it's only, what date is it? January the 8th. But how could I walk past the cream egg section and not get a pack of cream eggs? They have their Valentine section out, which looked really sweet. So I picked up two of these mugs and these reminded me so much of the Emma Bridgewater mugs. Like, look at that. That looks like the Emma Bridgewater hearts so much. I couldn't believe it and I think they were, how much were they? So those mugs were £1.50 each and I think the Emma Bridgewater ones are let's say a lot more, but the Emma Bridgewater ones are beautiful and I do love Emma Bridgewater ceramics. But if you're wanting like a little dupe or like just a little cute new mug, like for Valentine's Day or just any time of the year, I thought these were super sweet and definitely give off that Emma Bridgewater look. Like even the colors, like the dark pink and the light pink. The only thing I do wish is that the inside was white, just so it was a bit more of a neutral vibe, but I guess you'll have a drink in them so you won't see it too much. But yeah, how sweet. And then I saw this glass vase and it was £1.29. The cream eggs were more expensive than this vase and the cream eggs were more expensive than those mugs as well. But I just couldn't get over how cheap this was and also like how cute it is. It's like a, a bud vase, but a little bit bigger than a bud vase. It's got these like different flower patterns all along the outside. And then I thought that this would look really cute on like a windowsill somewhere with just like a small selection of flowers in like fresh flowers, that's what I'm thinking. Like daffodils or something like round Easter time or like white peonies or tulips, just any like small number of flowers so you could take like a few flowers out of like a bigger bouquet and pop them in here and yeah I just can't believe that it was £1.29 as well literally so cheap but so pretty then we went to Dunelm and I didn't get any like home decor bits as such but we did get a new bin a new broom and a new dustpan and brush so a little bit boring things to show you but they're nice and neutral and I like them so I'll show you those anyway so here's our new bin I don't normally have that stool there and like the vase and everything I just had it there for an Instagram photo that I was taking earlier in the day but I think this bin is so much better if if you have followed me for a while, you might remember the pink bin that I bought when I was in like my pink girly phase and we've just like kept it since then but it's just been bugging me like because obviously the kitchen isn't pink I don't really have pink accessories that much anymore and I think my friend Mel has this bin I think I saw it in a house when when she was showing us around a new house and I, I just thought it was nice and neutral and just matched and wasn't like didn't stand out like as you can see it just blends into the wall and no one really likes bins like I detest the bin so much <laughs> like I wish we, we I wish we had space for it in a cupboard somewhere maybe in the future we've got like a huge kitchen but for now I think this bin is perfect it blends into that white wall and looks quite pretty as well Blossom you are just adorable and you match the new bin Aren't you so cute? And then last but not least, here is our new broom and dustpan and brush. Very boring, but as you can see, they're quite nice neutral colours. 
and I have to say I have never used a broom and a dustpan and brush as much as I have since having rabbits and the one the current dustpan and brush we have is red and black which is not the vibe and our broom is like grey and dirty and we just needed a new one so yeah nice fresh broom and dustpan and brush for these little princesses what's that blossom? She's, I feel like she's grown so much since we last showed her. Hey, you're so sweet. Say hi, Blossom. Say hi to everybody. Look at that little paw. Oh, oh, sorry, baby. Is my hair in your face? I've just taken that vase, that £1.29 vase, and popped some of the roses that Jake got me inside. And I love how it looks. It's just so cute and pretty. I've not like properly styled up the kitchen for like New Year, like January yet, but I'm gonna be making a start and I really like how this looks. Also, I did buy the Air Up water bottle. I've seen loads of people talk about this on Instagram and TikTok and YouTube. So I thought that I would give it a go because I feel like my skin doesn't have enough moisture in because I'm not drinking enough water and I want to make it like my New Year goal to drink more water. Sorry if you can hear Jake rustling in the background. How dare he use tinfoil as I'm filming. <laughs> so yeah, I thought I would give it a go. I got the pink one, nice cute pink water bottle. And then essentially what it is, is you get these pods. I've got a peach one on at the minute and they have a scent to them. So like peach scent or what's this one? Uh, watermelon scent or raspberry lemon scent. And when you go to drink the water, your nose will smell the scent and it makes your brain think that you're drinking flavoured water so it's quite cool really it, like tricks your brain and it does work like I thought it would have a stronger scent taste but I can't complain like it does actually taste like I'm drinking peach water let me have another sip now it just kind of tastes like really faint peach water but like I only filled it up a few minutes ago and I've, I've drank that much already which is probably more than I used to be drinking in one whole day I'm really bad for it when I'm at work like I'm teaching I just don't have time to like drink my water but I'm trying to make it my new thing to drink more water so I'll be bringing this to work tomorrow and hopefully have two refills well no one refill in the day like fill it up at lunchtime and see how I go on I'm excited to try more of the flavours. I'm excited to try this one, the orange vanilla swirl. And they also do like a cola one, which is out of stock. So I imagine that one's a good one if it's out of stock. Raspberry lemon, I love anything raspberry. So yeah, I'm excited to give them a go. I also have a 20% off code. Like this wasn't gifted or anything. I bought it myself, but they gave me a 20% off code for people, like friends and family to use. So I will link that down below. I don't know if I benefit anything from it, but you will benefit 20%. 20% off your order. I found somebody else's 20% off code on Google somewhere on this like chat room and that worked and it saved me loads of money when I was like getting different pods and stuff. So I will link that down below in case you want to treat yourself and drink more water like me. So this is where I envisioned this to go, but I just don't know if I'm gonna have enough room now. Let me just move these bottles and see. Yeah, I just, I just think it looks a bit... It's like, it looks like two bowls, doesn't it? Well, it is two bowls. <laughs> right. Abort mission. <clears throat> That's where I thought it was going. Is it? Mm-hmm. <laughs> Florally Jake. <laughs> <laughs> we could have it here. I've taken out the Christmas stems from here, so that's why that's got nothing in, but I will be putting some like nice like white flowers or like foliage in there. Let's see what that looks like. Let's move these bottles back there for people to use, my lovely Neptune bottles. And let's, let's open the citrus soap, shall we? Oh my gosh, that citrus soap smells so good. It's so like, it's such a strong scent. It smells like Vervine from the White Company. I love it. And I do quite like how it looks. I feel like I can't really like judge it because there's no flowers in that. So I can't like get the overall vision. I have just found a napkin in the kitchen and I think I like it better with the napkin draped over. I just need to like faff with it a little bit, make this bit a bit longer. No, a bit shorter. <laughs> this, is, this is just my life. I literally just faff and make like the slightest amendments. Yeah, like that maybe. And then have some flowers coming out of the vase. 
yeah I like how that looks very bathroom-esque and brings a little bit of like warm tone like into this room a little bit so yeah like that so I'm gonna leave the video there everyone our tea is nearly ready Jake's just finishing off and it's a HelloFresh meal tonight who we love working with I absolutely adore the HelloFresh meals it's a barbecue pulled chicken burger and chips tonight which just is insane it looks like something we'd get at like TGI Fridays or something it's so exciting and I do also have a discount code for you to use as well I don't have to say this in this video by the way I just thought I'd mention it since we're having it for tea tonight so the code is 60 florally to save you 60% off your first box and then I think let me just check 25% off your next two months plus loads of free gifts as well so that's 60 florally to get you all those benefits so that's the end of the video everyone i hope you enjoyed coming shopping with us today and seeing all the bargain items that i found i'm really really happy with them especially the bars and those mugs like i just love everything that i got today really good finds and yeah let me know what you think down below i love to speak to you all in the comments and i will see you very soon with a new video bye